So, is temptation a sin? Well, surely we know from the Bible that Jesus himself was tempted. So perhaps it's more a case of how we respond, or rather don't respond, to temptation that is the heart of the matter. That look, if it turns to an action, can become a habit which has consequences. A downward spiral, a slippery slope leading to guilt or despair or even depression. Well, the Bible has some good news for us that God will not allow us to go through any temptation that we can't handle. But why does he even do that in the first place? Well, on one hand, temptation acts as a kind of check on our loyalty to God, a kind of tool to sharpen our spiritual disciplines. How close is the walk we walk to the talk that we talk? Well, Jesus himself, we know, passed the test with flying colours. He was not tempted in the wilderness, and I guess that's what we should expect of him. But what about us? What about you? And what about me? Well, first of all, it's good to remember that temptation does exist. It is a fact of life. It happens. Well, secondly, also to be aware of our own vulnerabilities the chinks in our armour, our own particular Achilles heels, the things that float our boats that could lead us astray. To be wary of them, to stay clear of them. In the words of a a well-known TV game show, if we come too close, get yourself out of there. And finally, let's not try and do this on our own. God has given us his Holy Spirit, yes, but he's also given us each other. So let's have each other's backs covered. Let's be open and accountable to each other. Let's not try this on our own, but with a little help from our friends. The world we live in is arguably more full of temptation than ever before. So that's certainly going to be necessary to keep our eyes opened, to see what's ahead and what's lying around the corner. It is certainly worth a thought. Well, this Sunday we're going to be looking at the issue of the Sabbath. Is it a day of rest or another opportunity to impose religious rules and regulations? But for now, do take care, stay safe and thank you for listening.